when I read in the paper that the Enbridge company was going to put a pipeline right through the heart of the most biodiverse, fabulous, freshwater territory of Minnesota, I knew that this was really going to be an important story to follow. In 2014, I attended one of Winona LaDuke's Love Water Not Oil horse rides against the current of the oil, and I learned that she was driven to do this ride because of the power of a dream. And so I filmed and photographed that ride. Soon after, I followed Winona to New York City and marched with the indigenous people in the People's Climate March. And walking along 6th Avenue with 500,000 people who recognize that climate change is the coalescing most urgent need we have on the planet to address this issue was so powerful. And then the next day going to flood Wall Street and seeing the whole economic system that backs this up and how powerful it is and that all these people were standing up to this major machine to say no, we have to stop this, we have to turn this around or our planet is doomed. And so that was very, very powerful for me. And I realized, oh my God, I have to make a film about Winona. And so I set off to follow her. And over these last two years, I have steadfastly been trying to keep up with Winona LaDuke, which is not easy at all, not easy.